it's here. It's finally here. The trailer for Auto Legends. Let's go through it together and check it out and see if we spy anything that is maybe out of the norm. I'm going to keep the video muted because I don't know if the music in the trailer is copyright or not, and we all know how YouTube is. But let's check this out. So this is the trailer uh, released 8-13-2024 uh, for you people that are not in America. Uh, that's August 13th. So <laughs> anyway, let's check it out. So right away we get the logo and the splash. I love the logo. It's so simple. Unleash your inner car enthusiast. True. Spectate races. Dude, the spectating races thing is going to be so freaking cool. I can't wait. And pick winners. Yeah. So you can... The whole idea there, and they've said this live elsewhere publicly, is you might be able to even do in-game currency bets on people that are currently live racing. Hey, 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 it's Brian. So, that'll be really cool. You can also join the community, go to meetups. There's going to be car meetups and stuff like that that are going to be absolutely awesome. You know, lining up your cars is going to be... it. The whole racing thing is going to be so much fun. I can't wait for this to be just more publicly accessible. It's going to be great. The customizing of your car, as you guys know from my deep dive series, is pretty in-depth. Um, You can do quite a bit, and this is just like the quote-unquote V1 of it. They want to take it even further, which I can't wait for that because that's going to be a blast. But overall, yeah. It's going to be pretty sick. Now, let's do a little bit of deep diving through this. See what we see that we shouldn't see. So, obviously, there's the logo in the 6th Street Bridge. We all know that 6th Street is a location actually on the map. As you can see here, you have the Eclipse. You have a RX-7. RX-7 seems to be the favorite car. If you guys remember... Uh, Racing Rivals, this was also one of the very first cars in the game. There's something about Mazda. I think I heard that they're just really easy to work with. Street credit is coming back, as you can see here. The 2049 versus 1642 street credit from the 1320 Legends days is making a comeback. And I've heard that it's actually going to mean something, which should be absolutely awesome. But you can do full screen, you can go back to the meetup, you can see how many people are watching. There's the crews and the DM, this is just the live chat. It's pretty, it's pretty awesome. Now let's look here, let's see what we see here. So this is an RX-7 Ford Probe, RX-7 Eclipse, way in the back there, another Eclipse. Supra, can't wait for the Toyotas. Another RX-7 and the R34, that's going to be awesome. Supra, is that a Supra? <laughs> I'm sorry, <laughs> that made my microphone peak. <laughs> is that a Supra? <laughs> I can't even help myself. OG13, representing. If you don't understand what OG13 represents, um, about two to two and a half years ago now, one of the uh, higher-ups for the game developers uh, for Autoverse Studios, reached out to um, Brian, a.k.a. Sesco, a.k.a. Explosion, if you played 1320 Legends or any of those games, and said, find like 13 people and bring them in. They're going to be the like thought tank, the idea guys, and very early QA and testers to see if we're just on the right track. And... Over the years, it is, over the last two years, it has grown to less than 13. We did just add somebody new to it. Uh, welcome to OG13, uh, Ganny, aka James. But it's an awesome little group. We all get along amazingly and can't really wait to see what we get to do further. So. As you can see here, you do have your avatars. You also have a team avatar, which looks sick. It tells you your RTs right down here, which is awesome. 
Somebody fouled negative point five right there. Gotta love that. And then you pass the crowd at the end. These little emoji things, if you haven't played the beta yet, you can actually throw them at your opponent while racing, which is awesome. And then obviously the pink slip, RX-7 versus Eclipse. I think the RX-7 is going to win every day. That's a good point. Now, customizing your car, I love the customization of this game already, and it's only going to get better. It's so nice. But overall, Fast Eddie's also an awesome way to buy cars. Can't wait for the other potential dealerships because I think they're going to do branded ones uh, or like time period, correct? I don't know, though. I don't know how it's going to work. But you can see we have the McLaren here. We have a Zonda and an Eclipse. What a very interesting garage. <laughs> Let me. And this is just the car I throw random cash at that I find in the cup holders of my McLaren and my Zonda. <laughs> I can't help that one. But you can also see here, JC, some of you might be able to guess who that is, offers you $3.1 million for your McLaren P1 GTR. That's awesome. They're going to be able to make offers to buy people's cars. They do want to have some form of a UCL. If you want to sign up for the beta, I believe mobile is going to be a part of beta as well. So all you can do is pay attention. Best place to pay attention is obviously the Discord. But uh, if you don't have Discord, pay attention to Twitter. If you don't have Twitter, uh... Yeah, <laughs> pay attention to Instagram, I guess. If you don't have Instagram, pay attention to Facebook. If you don't have Facebook, pay attention to the YouTube channel because clearly you're here. So I'll talk to you guys later. Hope you guys enjoyed the trailer. Peace out.